Sibin from Korea, World Championship, Milano 2023, and the team third place. Erbil Nisanor from, from Turkey, Junior World Cup, second place. On the video by Andreas Duvis. Underway and the first hit is for Erbil. Nice power report. So as the two athletes step into the middle, Troy just bringing her arm back, opening the door for Erbil's to tack. Well, Troy having a little think about uh, video review there, but uh, clear from our replays that that was Erbil's attack. And Choi, a bit more patient on her feet and scores her first point of this semi-final. It's been a very composed Erbil today. There's a lot of dancing about, but the final action does indeed come from the right-hand side. Erbil looking very composed. There has been a trend recently in fencing for a younger fencers to come through. Traditionally, mid to late 20s is when fencers were getting into their prime, and perhaps led by the USA's program that uh, gets university students up to the very top levels. The rest of the world is starting to follow suit. Oh, nicely done, finding a little hit on the inside. Yeah, final action is a remise from the left. So it's a first attack fails from uh, more mu uh, from uh, Choi. It's a, a continuation of the attack that lands to put it back within one. First one fails again from the Turkey athlete. We will go to the break with the smallest gap possible, 8-7. Parapost for the right there. Erbil is in control here. And that team. And comes back from Erbel on the attack. She had the right of way, but uh, gave it away here. You just see the hand just nudge back a tiny bit. Oh, nicely done. That's the control that she's got. Erbil, she used her feet to make Choi miss and then was very patient on the way forward once she'd got her turn to attack. So the attack failed there. On this occasion, we might see on the replay, she goes too low. Silver Jacket finishes at the waist 
And the elbow on the right hand side hits the bum of the Korean. Yeah, two waves of the wand. First one fails, and it's the second one that lands, and in between, Choi gets the right of way, made no mistake. Takes the lead for the first time in the match. Now, will we have a video appeal here? We get to have a look at it. It's a tight one. It is a tight one, you have to say. And uh, Choi does call for a video. Think right value of now with uh, Andres Duvis. Just stay on the side of him there, looking at the video. So it was a good call from Choi Se-bin on review. Valiev has changed his decision. Final action goes through, and Choi on that run of hits I talked about that Sabres can get on. And this time they repost, or the parry failing. Distance used by Erbil again, it worked good effect earlier on in the fight, but a beautiful parry repost from Choi Sabin of Korea. Sees her within two of the gold medal match here in Tunis. Attack para repost. Good use of the feet there from Erbil. Stepping out and using the blade to block. Well, that's a, a little bit of a confusing one because uh, the blade went into the guard from Choi. And that becomes a parry riposte, which is what the referees called. So a failed video from uh, Choi means she's only got one left, 13 apiece. She'll need to use it carefully. The first one misses from Choi. Another video call. Which way is this one going to go? The referee's going to have a good look at this one. And that is it. Choi has blown her two video appeals now and trails by a point. Erbil one away from making the gold medal match. But of course, 14-14, which has been the score of the day, is what we are left with here. Distance from Erbil, beautiful, absolutely stunning. She's shown us that move many times today. I counted four in the final, and that is an accomplished display from Nisana Erbil from Turkey. She's made the gold medal match of the women's sabre at the first Grand Prix of 2024 in Olympic year, and she will face Lucia Martin Portuguese from Spain. Referee has to look at the video at the end at 14-14 but the decision was clear. And Lucia Martin Portanez from Spain will face Nisano Erbil from Turkey in the women's gold medal match. That promises to be something special here. Well, celebrations from the coach, quite right too, as Erbil converts. A guaranteed bronze into a guaranteed silver.